Hello, my lovely Taurus. How are you, loves? I hope everybody is well. Taurus, today we'll do your reading for the last week of October. Weekly energy, loves. Take what resonates most, leave what doesn't. As you always know, Tauruses, might be for you, might not be for you. Let's hear, loves, what we got here and where we are heading towards, what the oracle speaks to you this week, and of course, what the messages are from the spirit and as well from the tarot cards. Taurus, we have peace energy, beautiful energy. It's kind of like the storm is gone and there is beautiful energies coming towards you. Also, Spirit says, make peace for with the things you cannot have or you cannot control at this time. Never-ending story and chaos and conflict. I feel here there is a, a week where is all the problems resolved. For some of you, my resurfacing a problem from the past. And you might think about it, what I got to do. Definitely, I feel here there is... There is some things here will come around to you. You know, we are still in Mercury retrograde. And yes, at the end of this week, we do have a full moon into your zodiac sign. So very strong energies coming to you, Taurus. But definitely here, there is a, there is a situation here might come around to you. You need to take care of it. And I feel here that your peace is more important than anything and anybody out there. So definitely here I see an a Taurus who does really good work. And as well, on the full moon might come things here, which you might not expect it. We're still in Mercury retrograde, as I've been said. And the Mercury retrograde goes all the way to November 3rd. Okay. And as well, the full moon energies, many times we we can feel it stronger a day or a two day, three days before and even a week after the full moon happened. Let's see here, loves, what we got for you, especially for this week. As you know, the energy comes in through right now. And for some of you, it might happen exactly this week. For some of you, happened or will happen. And for those of you who are not happened yet the situation or is try is right now happening, you can change some things about it because the predictions are for that. We have star energy, big wishes, big fulfillments. Also, there is speaking about um, a thing of, like heal the past things. And for some of you might come through your dreams some some um, some things and like answers whatever is there and i feel here you can benefit that whatever answers are coming to you through your dreams that will be put in the real life here eight of cups queen of wands and four of swords Underneath we have Six of Swords. There's somebody here. We have Aquarius and Fire Sign here. There's somebody here who, who is thinking to leave or they will leave. That could be you, that could be the other person. Somebody here is thinking very closely what should they do. What works for me and what doesn't work for me. We have two eights here. Could be a love situation, could be a work or even business situation. But definitely right now, it's it's quite a silence here. There's something here you, you want to achieve here. And it seems to me that, that will, you might need more time to. Let's see. Eight of Wands, another eight. We have three eights already. Let's see. Six of cups. Five of pentacles. Temperance. Magician. Somebody here wants to reconcile with you, loves. Somebody here who left. 
Eight of Swords. We have all the eights, my loves, here. Something here didn't really work in the past. Here. And I feel here you will talk with that person again. That could be a Sag, Aries, Leo with a chorus in the chart. But I feel here this person comes, comes back to you. And definitely they want to reconcile. And it's up to you, my loves, because I feel here you might be left by this person. You might work hardly for this connection. And it's something here like you need a more give and take energy with this person. We have six of swords, six of pentacles, six of cups, six of wands, overcoming the things. Also, it's kind of this person wants to win you over. After they le left you with a bitter mouse, definitely fire. I see a lot of fire energy. Let's see here. Five of pentacles. Why you feel that way? Knight of swords. They make very quick moves. Like, they didn't, you know, it's whoever left you here didn't really thought that they will come back it's like they they left like is no tomorrow page of pentacles you might might feel angry you might still have you know that anger or that thing like you know why you done this to me it's like you know this person you didn't even expect for them to do whatever he is here for some of you is somebody here who you even helped them in the long run or you help them financially and you know you you know or you knew that they will come around to you if they are leaving right now believe it or not they will come around to you because we have too many cards of coming back here six of pentacles Seven of Cups. You are a little confused. I don't know what to do at this time. I'm not sure what's my benefit in this. And it's it's something here you need to, to look deeper. Page of Swords. Get more information. Why? Okay. You might have air energy here. Or you are more in your air energy. More cerebral not as emotional but i feel here this person comes with a lovely offer and they come in fast they come in fast here eight of swords it's like even this person left or will leave they they're not going anywhere lovers somebody here fall in love you know them very well and they they don't see nobody besides you there's another card here reuniting with you it's like getting under your skin here but they they do know that the bond between you two it's something wow past life relationship here but i feel here could be you could be them but it's more likely them they could be done think not even thinking in the past you could help them a lot because i i see here there's something here about this person it's it's hard for them like they know you are the one for them this could be a twin flame energy here for you taurus they know you are their happiness they know that but it's hard for them probably to settle down, okay? It's hard for them to settle down. You very much focus on what you need to do. It's like you are focusing on the tangible things here. But I feel here you, you definitely know who is this person strongly. You know who are they are and how the energy for them playing here. Let's see here, one advice for you, Taurus. One advice for you. 
want to advise for my lovely Taurus. Seven of Wands, stand up for what you truly want at this time. King of Wands. Six of Swords. And Ace of Pentacles. I definitely see here this person is not moved on from you. That's that's for real. And it's another thing here, you you might see them different or you might see there is like it's like I do see it through you. But you left a bit bitter mouth here. It's quite sour energy here. But what I feel here, this person is coming in here because they don't see nobody better than you. And they are here to offer you something real at this time. Okay? If they left or whoever left from this, they're coming around. And if in the past they, they couldn't really you know, sell down or they have that fear of selling down or having something stable. Now they coming here. I feel here they needed some time to think. And now you need some time to think if you are letting them back into your life or not. But I feel here there's a big chance for you to letting go and to let them coming back. There are too many cards of reconciliation here. And I feel here for some of you that could be a twin flame which were runner and chaser energy here. Back and forth. I'm out, I'm coming back, I'm out, I'm coming back. That's why the, the never ending story here. So now you are thinking, should I go forward or not? That's a fork in the road, loves. That's a fork in the road. You definitely will will be around this person. I feel here this person is not going anywhere. They want to win you over. And they're coming for you. They're coming towards you. Okay. Alrighty, Taurus. I thank you so much for in tuning with this energy. Love and light all of you. And of course, we'll see you next time. Love and light. Namaste.